Alrighty guys, we are back. As you saw, we just finished that hidden quest. Uh, thanks to my friend hinting that we should go back to the road, which is kind of odd that we had to run so far back. But, you know, we got, we got it. And then we also unlocked slots for Fee and, uh, oh yeah, which is great as well. Uh, speaking of which, I just remembered, we had some quartz, right? So if I go to, we had this one in HP. So I feel like, I know I just mentioned, uh, be well, hold on, 649, 61, eh, okay, it's fine. Uh, but let's go that, let's give that earth one to, uh, Elliot. Ooh, excuse me. Um, I guess this one, you're right. So, hold on, what, what, uh, what do Machias have? Hold on. Is it the same? I think it is, right? Crest. Okay, sorry, it's just this one seems a lot stronger. Hold on, five turns, and then, uh, hold on one second. Sorry, guys. His was... No, it's the same. Okay, sorry about that. For some reason, I, I had it in my head that it, it did something better. All right, anyway, so let's go inside. So, Twin Dragon's Bridge waiting area. Okay. All right, so a couple of people we have to talk to. Uh, I guess we'll talk to everyone here first before the question marks. So, talk to man. No one told me a perm was needed to get through, and now they expect me to travel all the way back to town and apply for one? Just how long do they plan on delaying me before I go, before I can go see my family? One of them is sick. Oh, he meant the family, not the not the uh, the guys. <laughs> okay, I mean, actually, no, the, the noble lines are pretty sick, you know, doing this to people. All right, this is, oh, merchant. Whoops, merchant Maurice. Oh, how I long for those delicious omelets they made back in Keldic. I got the recipe, but recreating the same rich taste proving to be difficult. Why don't you give it a try? You might have more luck than me. Oh, cool. Okay, I wasn't expecting that, but it's all thanks. <laughs> <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, let's see. Munch, munch. <laughs> hmm. I've had better. Doesn't seem like the train will be back in order anytime soon, either. Maybe I should start thinking about moving on. Damn. I decided to try out the traveling merchant lifestyle, but the traveling part's a real pain. And the rumors about the trains being back in order soon were wrong, too. What a waste of time. I feel ya. Alright. Alright, who else can we talk to? That's not a exclamation point. <laughs> Alright, over here. These gentlemen. Oh, please. The fact that this fight's been going on for a month obviously means the 4th Division's still alive and kicking. The Provincial Army probably realizes they're a big threat, so they're doing everything they can to keep them at bay. Which means they'll only escalate from here, and then we'll get hit with even more taxes. Okay. Where are you getting your information? If His Majesty were bedridden with illness, then surely the Imperial Chronicle would have mentioned it. Alright, what about this guy then? What's he saying? Come on, man. The Armored Division is done for. The Cruzian Provincial Army crushed them, and now they're stuck fighting off Crossbell's forces. I even heard Crossbell's got some crazy powerful weapon they kept hidden, so this is going to be one bloody war. I'm, I'm, I'm guessing he's referring to um, one of the knights, you know? Uh, Oh yeah, word has it that His Majesty is bedridden with some illness, too. They're... Things are getting crazy, man. Yeah, I, the weapon he's probably talking about is Ordeen, which is a uh, crow's, uh, you know, mecca. <laughs> All right, this guy, Gorelia Fort. Blech, excuse me, <clears throat> Gorelia Fortress eradicated. I haven't been able to get in contact with my family in Crossbell since then either. Ugh, what am I supposed to do now? More importantly, when are they going to let me go back to Crossbell? All right, come on, let me go back to Crossbell. <laughs> All right, barrels. Let's see. Alright, let's see. Alright, these are rooms, I guess? Oh, okay. And this is... Merchant Gibson. This isn't good. This isn't good at all. Crossbell is the only place I can get Eastern Spices from. They're my main product, too, so I'm in deep trouble the railroad stays out of business. Okay. Uh, I find myself worried for the future of the railroad. Surely they won't allow one of Zumeria's... Uh, Z Zumeria, right? Yeah. Main lifelines to remain out of business. It has to come back. It has to. Okay. Man, everyone's got their own troubles and worries, that's for sure. Okay, and then... What the heck? Yep, now good. But it does sound like there's someone inside, so let's check it out later. <laughs> What's over here? Oh. This area is for authorized personnel only. Oh, I see. Okay. Whoa, what the... What the heck? Oh. Huh, there's a grate right here. Cool. Okay. Maybe someone's going to do some Metal Gear Soliding later. <laughs> Alright, so we talked to most of the people, but let's go ahead and talk to the ones with the uh, qu exclamation point. So let's see. Robert? Everything's been a disaster since this war broke out. 
First my waitress ran off, and now I'm swamped with more customers than I can handle. Times are tough for all of us. By the way, might I ever ask how tight security is here? I want to take some pictures, so I'm wondering if it'd be cool to head out back and snap a few. Yeah, you definitely don't want to do that. Putting aside the fact that this is a military base, this place has been real tense for a while now. Trust me. Here, give it up before you do something you regret. I see your point. Well, thanks for the heads up. Ugh, oh boy. Anything else? Pretty much everyone's been stuck here for a while now. They're pretty tense, so do us all a favor and don't try anything funny, alright? And while I'm at it, don't pay attention to any of the rumors you hear. There's a lot of misinformation flying around. Only thing you can believe right now is that this place's service has gone down the drain ever since my waitress ran off. <laughs> oh, whoops. Sorry. Third one. There's so many rumors flying around right now that it's hard to discern what's real or fake. Sorry. Wish I could help you out more. Alright, um, anything I can buy from you? Oh, wow. Healing. Lots of stuff. Okay. Um, comforting cappuccino and tricolor onigiri. Very nice. Alright. Battle skills will definitely buy, but let me see if there's anything else we need to get. Tear bombs. Tear bombs. EP charges. God, they're so expensive. Um, okay, I think we're good. So let's just go ahead and get more battle scopes, though. So let's buy... Let's see. We have 9,000. I don't want to spend too much. Let's get, like, maybe 10? Just 1,000 of them? Yeah, let's do that. All right, that's good. All right, so that's Robert. So let's go ahead and talk to... Who's this guy? Uh, okay, just Merchant. Man, this is the first time I had to deal with this crap in all the years I've spent passing through here. I even went through the trouble of getting a permit, and yet they're still making me wait. Excuse me, can I ask you a question? You said you've been here a few times before, correct? You wouldn't have to know of any tunnels or passageways the maintenance staff might use, would you? Now, that's a weird question. I did know a guy who did maintenance here, but I never asked him about that. If it ain't gonna get- if it ain't gonna net me a profit, then I'm not interested. Ah, I see. Thank you for your time. We'll have to try our luck elsewhere. <laughs> Getting a permit is a damn pain. Then they have the, the gall to make me wait here a whole day. How much do they think it costs to stay here? Okay. All right, one more person. So uh, let's go ahead and talk to this guy in the corner. This is Merchant Orgus. Everyone's panicking real bad now that the railroad's out of commission. Hehe, <laughs> but that just means riches await those who weather the storm until it's back in business. That's why you guys are here, too. Am I right? Not exactly. You look like a man who knows stuff. <laughs> what do you think of telling us all you know about the, any kind of railroad inspections coming up? <laughs> I'm afraid inf info like that will cost you, darling. Or it normally would, but there's no not much to share based on these past two weeks. In fact, the railroad's been pretty much completely abandoned. Even I'm sweating a little now. We'll have to keep asking around. All right, riches, riches definitely guaranteed for those that stick it out here until the railroad is back in business. Doesn't look like that's going to happen anytime soon, though. Even I'm sweating at this point. Anything else? Nope. Okay, so I think we talked to everyone. We just have to go into that corner right here. So, uh, I guess we can walk through. <laughs> I couldn't help but notice that you seem to be in need of some assistance. Wow, that is one of the most gaudy voices I've heard in a long time. <laughs> oh, this is the guy at the door. Huh? And who might you be? Oh, no one out of the ordinary. Just another merchant forced to waste away here. All right, hold on one second, guys. Okay, sorry about that. <laughs> Just making sure everything's running fine. I've been watching you surreptitiously snoop around, you see, and I have a feeling you would welcome a stranger's helping hand. That's why, out of the kindness of my heart, I decided to lend you just that. Only if you'd like, of course. Uh, um... Sorry, but we're a little tied up at the moment. Mind finding someone else to buy whatever you're selling? My, my. Batting away my generosity, are we? You're so cold. Perhaps we should take a moment to have Class 7 weigh in on the matter rather than you, Bracer. He's like, how does he know? <laughs> how do you know who we are? Who are you? <laughs> an excellent question from an inquiring mind. Let us set a little wager, then. I'll tell you exactly who I am, if you catch me. <laughs> hey! Get back here! <laughs> this is awkward. There's no one here. And it's a dead end. 
You're joking. Don't tell me he just upped and vanished into smoke. I sincerely doubt that. Wait. I can feel a breeze around here. Oh, yep. It was the the grate we saw earlier. Okay. I thought it was going to be that door on the left, but I guess it's, it's this one then. Looks like he went through here. <clears throat> it's a ventilation shaft. No wonder. Could it lead to where I think it does? We won't know until we go through it. I'm curious where that guy went too, so let's go for it. All right, I guess down the shaft we go. Yeah, I guess we have no choice. Let's go. Traveling through the jungle cuts the main story to advance. As a result, all unfinished quests will disappear. Yeah, let's enter. We've done everything. At least everything I can think of, so let's go ahead. <laughs> oh, God. Whoa, what is this? Can I actually... Oh, wow. Okay, sorry. I was curious. Like, I, that's new to me. I didn't know you could do that. Yeah, let's enter the duct. <laughs> Sorry about that. I was like, what is going on? First person crawling. It's so dark in here. Too bad. If you were a cat, you'd have good night vision like me. But I'm totally fine, and I'm not a cat. Right, anything over here? Nope, dead end. <laughs> My turn. Okay, leave this to me. Here I go. <laughs> Can you imagine them switching places in, in this tight... Tight corridor. How funny would that be? All right. Hopefully, nothing bad or comedic happens. Like, uh oh. You think that guy even came in here? Beats me. He's not someone you see every day, for sure. Okay. Here. Understatement of the century. I guess we're going down. Here we go. Oh. Okay. I thought it was gonna slide us down. Dang. <laughs> I was all excited for nothing. All right. Here we go. Do 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 do. All right. Here we go. We found our exit. Twin Dragon's Bridge, Celtic side. Okay. I wonder if that... I think I know where it is. Hang on. Woo! That was one narrow duct. Wait. Isn't this... Okay, yep. I was right. It was under uh, that one area that we saw the yellow, yellow square at outside. It's the Transcontinental Railroad's tracks. Thought so. Guess we don't need to worry about how to get on them anymore. Yeah, sure, but what happened to that hooded man? I can't see him anywhere. I wonder where he went. I can't sense him nearby either. Well, it does bother me that he seemed to know who we are, but I think we're better off forgetting about him for now. We need to focus on crossing to the other side of the bridge. Agreed. He was suspicious, but I didn't get the feeling we were enemies. Now, at least. You don't think that this was some elaborate way of helping us out, do you? Uh, I think that's being a little too optimistic. We still we still got what we wanted in the end. Let's follow these tracks and get inside the fortress. Yeah, and they shouldn't be able to spot us up from up there. Ugh, excuse me. Yeah, and they shouldn't be able to spot us from up on the bridge either. You guys ready to go? So are we giving control? Oh, okay, we are giving control. Can I actually go back? No, I can't. Okay, wow. Um, can I actually go this way? <laughs> I'm just curious. Probably not. Alright, this is one of the towns that on the Transcontinental Railroad. I can't say I feel safe wandering in here. That's right, we don't get run over by a train, so let's just keep going, I guess. <clears throat> so I guess... Wow, I, Oh. Please don't let them spot us. So far, so good. Well, at least they're not raining mortar shells on us. That'd be pretty bad. <laughs> Alright, let's just... I guess we can just run it. Run and gun it. Anything over here? Nope. That'd be a ride. We just stopped just to fish <laughs> on this dangerous bridge. All right, so let's just... Wow, that was it, huh? Nothing? Okay, let's just uh, move on. Screw it. Wow, very simple. <laughs> We're going on an adventure, guys. All right, now who was that hooded man, though? Seriously. You gonna take off the hood? <laughs> well, there they go. I'm afraid that's as much help as I can give. The rest is up to you. I'll be offering up a prayer to the goddess for your success. Why does that voice sound super familiar? I can't remember. It looked like he was wearing glasses, though. 
Yeah, I can't remember. Damn. It's, all, it's probably on the tip of my tongue, too, but... No, not on the tip of my tongue. Just can't remember. All right. Uh, I guess anyway. Whoa. Okay. Well, yeah. Whoa. That's a lot of soul dots. I guess they're all being transported somewhere. Oh, and there it goes. Oh, there's a conductor up on that bridge right there. Can you see him? Okay, never mind. Not conductor, the asshole leader. <laughs> the soldiers are ready for deployment, sir. I see. Excellent. The time has come for us to put an end to their pesky tactics. Listen up. Duke Alberia has personally ordered us to clear the 4th Division up ASAP. We'll even have some extra assistance this time, too. Be sure to slaughter every last one of those treacherous scum. Yes, sir. Ugh, I, I, this is probably the same guy from the first game, too, right? Remember he tried to arrest everyone when we cut out the whole um, problem in the forest of Lunaria Park? <clears throat> Look at how many soldats they had ready to go. This is much worse than we anticipated. Yeah, they even had them deployed over by Trista, too. Just goes to show that things are only going to get fiercer between them and the Imperial Army. I hope Dad's okay. I wouldn't worry too much about him. I mean, it's Craig the Red we're talking about here. Seems like the 4th Division's fought them off a bunch of times by this point, too. That explains why they're so desperate to finish them off. We probably shouldn't be hanging around here. Yeah, true. We should head down to this line, right, V? Yeah, it branches off further down the line so we can get off there. Alright, let's get moving. Wow, look at this. <laughs> oh, okay, cool. Treasure chest. Oh, wait, no. I don't think we can... Oh, uh, yeah. It looks like we can't climb up on the thing. So let's... Well, we c I think we could. Hold on. All right, no. There's no ridge. There's nothing I can climb up on, I think. Let me see if I can get a good angle. Yeah, there's nothing I can climb up on. Damn, I want to get that treasure chest. It's like... It's teasing us, man. It's like, hey, you want that treasure chest? You want that treasure chest? Oh, sorry. We can't give it to you. Come back later. <laughs> I can't even, not even a voice over to see it. Oh, well. All right, let's go. So, Gorelia side. Let's go, guys. Cool. We're making progress. At least I hope we are. All right, so. Oh, there's more treasure chests and enemies. Uh oh. I'm, I'm assuming we're going to have to ignore them, I guess. Or do we have to go down somewhere? All right, so there's Gorelia by road right there. So, I guess we take that. Let's go at the very end first. Oh. We're through. Take a right to get to the by road. Yeah, okay, we're gonna go there, but I'll, again, I want to investigate a bit, so let's go over here this way. Huh, stoplights. I'm guessing that's when they change tracks or something. Alright, I'm just curious. Let's go down this way. <laughs> Alright, going this way will keep us on the. Oh, okay, we don't want to go this way. Alright, same thing. Alright, that's fine. Darn, I was actually just curious what all the way down there leads to, but oh well. So here we go. Uh, how far are we on the map? There we go, okay. Just speed things up a bit. Let's just run. Oh. Okay. Go through that gate and we're good to go. Someone certainly knows their stuff. It's Tovel. He knows the lay of the land. <laughs> Hold on. I just want to see the same message again. It probably is. Probably better for us to not go in this tunnel. <laughs> okay. Wise, wise words, Reen. Wise words. Alrighty. All right, so go through the gate, I guess. So we just walk through. Huh. Oh, yeah, and check out this music. Very interesting. Okay. Um, before we move on, let's check the map. All right, so Twin Dragons Bridge Gorelia side. Oh, wow, there's a lot of ground to cover, huh? Okay, so I don't know. Do Are we supposed to go back to the Gorelia side to go to that one area we missed, or we just go on forward? That's the thing. Hmm. I think we should. We should check the left part first before we go down this road. I get the feeling that that's what we're supposed to do. Oh, hold on. Alright. Whew! We finally made it to pass the Twin Dragons Bridge. This road takes us all the way to Gorelia Fortress, doesn't it? Yep, it's called Gorelia By Road, by the way. It's, I've been down this way before on a previous job, so I'll lead the way. 
Keep your eyes peeled. It may be paved, but still pretty harsh trek. Barely anyone uses it now because of the railroad, so who knows what could be hanging around. <clears throat> they caused it off completely when the war broke out, too. So we probably don't need to worry about being spied by any provincial army soldiers. I know we can't relax yet with so, with so far a walk ahead of us, but that'll at least make things easier on our end. Tobol, does Bracer work always have you guys traveling through places like this? You guys got your work cut out for you. <laughs> Gotta go where the requests demand. Though, hey, it's still way better than what I used to do. Oops, just ignore that. <laughs> um, seriously, you can't just stop there and expect us to not be curious. Well, I mean, it's nothing major or anything. <clears throat> we still got a long way to go to Corellia Fortress. Let's move. There's monsters looking around too, so stay alert. Got it. Time to go meet up with Dad. Oh, what's with this aerial view? Is someone watching us? Oh, okay, I guess I was right. Oh, great, it's those two. Fee six senses. <laughs> She's like, I know you're there. Okay, so. It definitely seems like we're going to go forward, but let's see if we can actually go back this way. Let's check. I guess we can. All right, hold on. So this is probably the bridge that we passed, right? The underpass? Yes, it is. All right, cool. So uh, we still got a few minutes left. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and explore this area. Try, maybe we can go back that way, the central area. and then if Or if not, then we'll just backtrack. So let's check it out. But let's go ahead and see what the shop owner has. Surprisingly, I don't know why he's having a shop here. But, oh, Merchant go jo Gillette. Damn it. Why are they carrying out super strict security checks all of a sudden? I can't let them look through my stuff. They'll find out I've been fiddling my taxes. Ugh. <laughs> Someone's having a great day over there. Or here. Yeah, yeah, laugh it up. Hold on. How about you buy something? At this rate, there's no telling when I'll be able to get back to peddling. If you guys could take some of my goods off of my hands, I sure appreciate it. I don't see why not. Really? Th thanks, man. All right, what do you got, though? Want anything else? Crap. I can't believe I'm stuck here. If I known it was going to come to this, I would have filled everything out properly. No. If I'd done that, how would I even make a profit? Those tax rates are some kind of bad joke. <laughs> okay. Alright, let's see what you got, though. Whoa, look at all this stuff. Contact lenses. A set of very small lenses that can be applied directly to the eye. If you have these, you don't need glasses. So, they're for Machias? Wait, does he have them already? It says equipped okay. I don't get it. I guess they're just a clothing accessory, so... But we don't need them. Um, okay, he's got some healing items. Still pretty expensive. And then... Let's see. Battle scope. We already bought some food items. Um, I do feel like I should uh, restock on some. No, we're, I think we're good. We're, we haven't been cooking food in a while, so we're fine here. But Master Quartz. Nope, just Megalith. Uh, exchange is nothing. Nothing here. Okay, let's just move on. If we had the Bison, we'll come back. But anyway, let's at least get some action. Oh. I don't think it's a good idea to go right in front of the Twin Dragon's Bridge. Oh, I see. Okay, that was on purpose. Because as you, if you can tell from the map, it's like highlighted on top of it. So obviously it's like a, it's like the bridge itself is hiding us from the enemies from the, well, the provincial, the provincial army from the other side. So, okay, that makes sense. But dang, I, I wanted to go over here and fight some enemies. Oh, well. All right, so that's it for the merchant, I guess. So let's just go back. <laughs> You know what? Oh, before we go, I just want to take one last look at something. So if we go to my notebook, recipes. Okay, so oh, let's make one with Fee. It's Fee's cooking power hour. What? You can try eating it if you want. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, Fee, don't ever change. Okay, so we got all of those. Let's see if we can make a. Vegetable juice. Let's try Fee, I think. Cooking power hour. Yeah! Power cooking! It's good! Yay, it's ready! Awesome. Alright, one more time. Let's use um Elliot. I hope this turns out okay. Come on, Elliot. <laughs> this is my specialty. Nice. Harmonic juice. Alrighty, cool. Alright, and last but not least, let's do the cheese omelette. 
All right, Elliot. Let's uh, look, not Elliot. Screen, screw this up for us. Okay, let's give this a try. Not what I had in mind. Wow, explosive omelet. <laughs> All right, uh, let's do one more with let's let's try Elliot again. Turns out okay. He was the master of omelets in the in the first game. Oh, this looks pretty nice. Okay, uh, queen omelet then. So let's try one more time. But let's do Fee. It's Fee's cooking power hour. All right, will it be the best one? This one's my specialty. Oh, it's a, that's It'll a surprise. Oh, okay. Speed scramble. Cool. All right, cool. So, so far, oh, we filled out everything so far. Is that actually nice to know? All right, so anyway, um, sorry about that. I want to get in at least one fight before we uh, move on. So, let's do that. Or split the part. That's what I meant. All right, enemies over here. Bring it on you. What is that? Ha! Oh, well. You're going to die. Now's our chance. We can do this. My turn. Let's see, it's a turtle bug. Oh, we fought that one thing before. I think. Hold on. Let's see. Battle scope. <laughs> Alright, turtle bug. An anthropod an, an arthropod, sorry. Monster with a hard shell stores venomous gas in its body, which it is uses to attack foes, so it's weak against water. Alrighty. Here we go. Alright, definitely tough, so. It's my turn. Let's use aqua bleed. Makis will shoot it. My turn. Eat that! All right, go for it, Elliot. Try this. Nice. Oh, we did it! All right, cool. Okay, let's just check. I think there's a chest there, right? Yep, there's a chest. So we'll check it out. Let's see what it is. Celestial bomb. All right, cool. Okay, so, making some decent progress. So, let's see. So, we'll go here. I'm just trying to figure out the route. All right, pretty basic. Okay, guys, so let's go ahead and split the part again. So, I'm going to go ahead and save. It's going to be at the bottom again. Here we go. <clears throat> All right, completely saved. Sorry about that. Let me, I was just checking my monitor again. Hang on. Ah. Uh, so annoying. <laughs> Give me a second. Okay, it's back on. <laughs> Sorry. Again, it's it's just so annoying that's been happening lately. Do, do, do. Okay, so give me one sec, guys, and then we will continue on the by road. 